although it's tied up in the history of the various places, the, the British are relatively international because of their uh, ex because of their experience with Empire and Commonwealth. Canadian investors tend to be very much focused on North America, you, I, I think mostly Canada, and, and, and if anywhere else you say it's, it's the U.S. Hong Kong, on the other hand, the world, everything. The people in Hong Kong look at everything. There's, they, there's funds available in any currency. You can you can have your bank account in different currencies. You can put your depo time deposits in multiple currencies. So you have a much more international outlook in Hong Kong, and also the Hong Kong people. I think partly because of that, are much more uh, take a lot of risk, look at different things. I, I, over the years, I've to tell you one of my best investment decisions was investing in May Life Stock, the company I've been working with for so many years. It's done historically done very nicely. Um, I've also I've also bought property in both um, London and in Hong Kong. It's done quite well for me. I don't never look upon stamp collecting as an investment. I guess uh, over the years, if you build a good collection and. and by, by, by sensibly, you, you, it isn't a good investment, but I don't think in those terms, I don't put it on my personal balance sheet because I'll never ever sell it. You know, Maybe my kids might think so you know, one day, but it's, it's, so it's, uh, it, it can be a good investment, but I don't think that's the way most, most collectors approach it. That's a very complicated question. It all depends, it, if you particularly got old stamps, it all depends on the condition of the stamp. It's in really good, nice and clean one, if it's uh, never been hinged, never been stuck in an album, that's very positive. Uh, uh, if so, sometimes very technical stuff, whether it's got a rare watermark or, 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 or different perforations, there's all sorts of things that can make a stamp particularly valuable. So I'm, 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 I've been work luckily I've been working for a financial services company for many years and they provide me quite well in my retirement. Uh, the word rich is highly relative, you know, I mean, it's, you know, if you, Bill Gates certainly wouldn't think I was rich, <laughs> but uh, uh, I would guess on a global perspective, I'm certainly not poor.